I love working remotely, but anytime I have something personal to do during the workday, my entire schedule gets flipped on its head. This is my work schedule for the day, so I'm gonna show you the most realistic day in the life of an independent consultant. I was supposed to have an interview at nine o'clock, but it got moved to Friday, which I'm happy about because <laughs> I was about to take the call in my car. Don't recommend you doing that. I just finished one of my client calls. I had to pull over a couple of times to talk and look at some things that were being presented. Now one of my other clients wants to talk, so I'm just waiting for them to give me a call. Hello, how are you? I know, when it rains it pours, it's like one thing after another. Oh. Oh, okay, so I'd have to review some of the uh, communications that we had with the agency to confirm when we said we would do this. I just got to my appointment, but I need to send an email really quick before I run inside. Okay. I'm sweating. See, I just took three meetings in my car. I'm gonna go into this coffee shop until I have to leave at 3.30. I worked at the coffee shop for a couple hours and then I got really hungry, so I went to North Italia and of course I worked through lunch. When you're a consultant, everything is an emergency, so I'm always getting pinged or called throughout the day. I got my hair done around five o'clock, but when I got home, I still had a bunch of work to do and worked into the night. I look like a ghost because I'm tired and it's 11 o'clock at night. But as a consultant, if you don't work, you can't bill. And if you can't bill, you can't pay your bills. My schedule isn't like this every day, but when it is, I just manage 